What's up, everyone? So we're at the end, end of prey. I think about 15 more minutes, we'll finish it. Uh, we have a decision to make: Are we going to destroy the station, or are we um, going to use a null wave? I think I'm gonna go with the null wave. To be honest with you, and we are weak as hell. We have no mech hits either. That's the second part about this. That's cure for you. We can use that. Our suit. Let's repair that. We are pretty low on everything. We've been getting our ass kicked. That's why. Uh, we have extra shit though. I had a shit. If I can find a repair vendor, I can. Uh, I'm not a repair vendor a recycler, maybe I can make some more stuff, but at this point I have no shotgun. I have a pistol bullet with no shotgun. I have to use uh, the Q beam. The Q beam is fully upgraded, it has a lot of bullets, but. Alright, well, Luther, got... I just failed that somehow. That's fine. Where am I supposed to go to? I think it's this one, right? I can escape too as well, but that'd be fucked up to you. Oh, we're at this place. Hold on a second. Where am I supposed to go here? Uh, I think I want to go with this one. Uh, if we can make it back. We're gonna actually, we're we'll, gonna we'll try to fabricate that if we have enough. Let's quick save it here so we have all this health. We're gonna have to run it. That's the shitty part about that. I mean, because there is a recycler, uh, there is one here. The re recycler. And plus, there is a, um, what do you call those things? Workstations. So we'll do that. We'll see when we use no wave. We'll see what happens. Um, I hope it's the right decision. I mean, the no wave is going to kill everything on the ship, but and the ship will be still uh, functional. Well, because like if we destroy the station, I feel like everyone we save is going to die. You know what's the point? The reason why they're worried, uh, Jenny is worried about, is that some of the shit's going to survive and be able to go to Earth or some shit like that, but I don't think that's going to happen. Because I would think that if you destroyed the whole ship, that fucking objects with stuff like, uh, with the, um, the mimics and stuff would be on that and would be able to go back to Earth. Uh, so, I'm just thinking, I think I want to go with the Null Wave. I really do. Could be a da uh, bad decision, but I don't know. I mean, we, we have, like, three decisions, really. We could escape right now if we wanted to. Um, and just leave this alone, but... Oh, you know this creature's outside. There's like this huge ass motherfucking monster. Let's see if we can dodge it. Microgravity detected. If the idea hasn't occurred to you, I'm sure it will eventually. Don't do it. I can't predict what would happen if you scan the apex, but all my models point to suffering. We could scan that. I hate I hate this macro gravity. There's no power here. Alright, so we actually have to go back. We can't use these. Maybe the power plant has the recycler. I want to try to scan now, if we can get any more scans. Because we only need one more. Oh. 
I'm good. I'm dying actually. Warning. Suit integrity damaged. Oh, it's following me. Ah. That's gonna happen. Honestly, I should just load my save. Uh, maybe not. Because I want to see what chipset I would get if I scanned all three. But yeah, there's no power. So like, how am I going to craft the fabrication? So we have to go to the power plant. And the power plant is life support? It's not the lobby, is it? Where the fuck would it be? I don't remember. We get, I guess we can go through the lobby too. We, no, it's not life support. I think we have to go lobby. Once we go lobby, we go to the security station. It's going to be a lot of load times, guys. I'm sorry. But we're going to check our chips out here. I'm so eagerly to beat this game and it takes forever to load. That's why you can't play this game for long, man. Like, if I'm in the hour and then I have to hit sit through load screens, it's like, what the fuck? That's not patience at that time. Have the new chipset. Proud, increase your movement speed while sneaking. No, what's this one? Can we just take that? We can take that one out and increase the PSIs. So we'll take that out. Put that in. I'm pretty sure we go lobby here. We're so in trouble, man. Like at this point, all I can do is repair my suit armor. And I'm, I, I, just, I had 30 of those armors, and now I have nothing. It says to keep them going down, so we got life support. <laughs> Looks like there's some fucking shit in there anyway. I think it's this way out. Oops, this way. Do you have a med kit? We're not gonna use the med kit until we get to like a spot we want to go to. Like we're good and. But I mean, if we can't fabricate the null wave, then we, we have like no choice at that point. We're gonna have to destroy the ship. Unless that, I'll fight creatures for ship. I don't know if I want to do that. Because I, I, if there's a boss battle at the end of this, I need the cube beam ammo. I need that 777 cube beam because I only have 20 pistol ammo and no shotgun. I do have the. I think you pronounce it kinetic blast. So I upgraded that fully. That's pretty strong. So, and then I had I put the chipset in, so it increases the damage of that by a small amount, but it's still damage, you know. So it should be interesting to see how much damage I would get out of that chipset. I don't know. Maybe I have to fight that thing outside. That'd be crazy fight. It'd be like Dead Space type shit. I think it was the Dead Space Three that that huge ass monster you had to fight at the end outside the ship. I think number one had one too, though. But this one was huge in Dead Space 3, I think. It's a great mimic. I 
right, let's try, we're trying to get a little no confrontations here. Unless it's a mimic? It's a weaver. I still don't have the resources at the moment to spend to fight those things. Especially a weaver. You have to take down the shield on that shit. No, I just can't do it. Right, we're in the power plant though, so we're, we need, we're at where we need to be. But, I mean, there should be power here for a fabricator or um, the recycler or the workstation. If I had to reset the power again, that would be annoying. I just feel like we're going to get stuck. Because <laughs> I feel like, I don't know, I don't have enough resources to fight a battle. The long battle that is. Either way, I would have to find a cheap spot to, like, cheese it. There's no, it's crazy, there's no low time coming up as well. Warning, dangerous level of explosive Whoa. detected. Please evacuate and avoid all open flames or sparks until... Alright, that's fine. How can he cast that bolt still when I just fucked him up with that? The glue gun. Jesus. Let me left off right here. Oh, is that the, we'll have to run it. Oh, why did I have one right here? Warning. Dangerous level of explosive gas detected. Please evacuate and avoid all open flames or sparks until repairs can be made. Warning, dangerous level of explosive gas detected. Please evacuate and avoid all open flames Welcome. or sparks until Maybe repairs I can, help. can be made. Hey, come here. Warning, dangerous yeah. level of me? explosive gas detected. Please evacuate Are and avoid me? all open flames Okay, summon a new operator, because this guy's not helping me. Hey, he came in here, seriously? Welcome. Maybe I can help you. Diagnosing superficial injuries. Nothing a portable medical kit can handle. I'll have you feeling better soon. There. All better. Don't forget to complete a patient questionnaire. Your feedback will be invaluable. Please don't harm me. Diagnosing. Looks like you've had a rough day. I'll have you feeling better. All done. I'll save off this, actually. Please fill out a service questionnaire at the front desk. Is she still in here? Yeah, she left. Detected. Please evacuate. Wait, I mean, if these operators work, then they mu the fabricator must work downstairs. Why did that open right away? Something over here? Hey guys, this is where everything comes down to. Alright. It's just like an alien. Or alien, the movie aliens.
How do I trigger it? I think we have to go upstairs. Oh, it's right here. Oh, right? How do we trigger it? Hmm. Well, Alex is unconscious, so he can't stop us. Unless he somehow... Welcome. Warning. Hold on a second, let me see where I have to go. Uh, level okay. of explosive let's go back to where warning. we were, guys. Dangerous so level of explosive gas detected. Please evacuate and avoid all open flames or sparks until repairs can be made. Pretty fast, bro. I don't know if that guy can catch me. Warning. Warning. Dangerous level of explosive gas detected. Please evacuate and avoid all. <laughs> we have to go through all these low times again, bro. Come on. That's why this video takes forever, honestly. I may just cut this video, honestly. Like, we were there at the beginning. Maybe I'll cut it that way. That's what I'm gonna do, so you guys don't have to sit for this fucking bullshit low times. You won't see the. I guess you won't see, uh. Um. January. <laughs> zap, uh, Alex to make him unconscious. Because we were gonna use a null wave, but. Uh, I think it's not worth it. I think you guys just. I'll cut it for you guys. This way, not to sit for all this long on this video. So I'll leave off where I'm putting, uh, pressing that button when we jump into the power plant. This will be easy to cut. Let's hope we didn't get killed by this weaver. Wow, that's scary. What the fuck is this? Oh, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Oh, jeez. Uh, I almost died there. Yeah, sometimes you can get stuck on ledges and shit in this game. It's weird. Guys, almost done the game. I, I, I know for a fact those people or that doctor guy is gonna give me shit. It's like fuck you, Morgan. I could escape on that guy's shit. I'm like, ah, oh, fuck. But this, I mean, like, I don't know how else would I. Uh, I had to save those people in the oxygen, uh, in the cargo bay by turning the oxygen back on. So I don't know how I wouldn't be able to kill him. And then he's trying to get into Alex's office. See, I saved Alex too, though. I mean, it doesn't really matter at the end. January is right. I mean, I save all these fucking people. They're just going to die on this ship. Unless there's some secret way they can get off. But I couldn't save that guy, the captain of the ship. I just couldn't. have one more load screen and then I think we're good guys. Let's 
should be our last low screen. We should be good. Also, you know what? Another series I want to play is Devil May Cry. I didn't play 1, 2. I don't know if I played 3. I think I was when I was little I played 3. But I only beat the first boss, I think, in 3. And I don't know. Devil May Cry 4. I don't remember playing that. I know I played the newest Devil May Cry, and I liked that a lot. I know a lot of people hated that for some reason. I thought it was pretty cool. I guess people don't like the character, that the main guy. But he, I didn't mind him. But yeah, guys, I guess once we go to the bridge, you're going to see Alex unconscious. That's because uh, January zapped him because I was going to use a null wave. But January said I, I would have to kill him to use it. And I was like, fuck that. I can't kill January. Yeah, guys. Oh, and then I'm going to kill everyone. Right? So, see if Earth wasn't involved, I would fucking use a null wave. But apparently, the ship's right close to Earth. <laughs> so, gotta do it. Microgravity detected. Morgan, I, I had to restrain Igwe several times by punching him. Who knows? I may have killed him. He tried to disable January. If you try to do the same, I can't let you do it. Oh, it's too late. It is... This station is proof of what happens when Tronstar conducts operations unchecked. If the research survives, then the crimes here will continue, and these aliens, if even one survives, they'll escape again oh, I'm sorry. and again. Alex made his choice. Now, it is up to you to make the right one. If you want to trigger the null wave, You'll have to come through me. My, yeah. I already made the shoes. I just, I, don't they know I armed the fucking keys already? I'm gonna destroy the ship. Nah, that's another thing she's right about. I was just gonna keep on making your mods. Like, I'm just gonna repeat the same process over and over again. It's bullshit. Let's finish it for all. At this man, I'm gonna get some food. See, I had the Silent Hill collection, but I don't think I'll play on the Xbox One. It's like the HD collection, but it comes with one, two, and three. Alright guys, here we go. Let's quick save it. Now I see, I see Alex use in con conscience. I'm aware that you primed the arming keys to destroy Talos 1. So I find the activation of this null wave transmitter station puzzling. The directives you gave me require I do everything in my power to ensure you destroy Talos 1 and all the Typhon. Detonating the station safeguards the Earth and perhaps provides a small measure of reparation. I won't relinquish control of the terminal. If you want to activate the null wave, you'll have to kill me. I don't understand. So how do I... Should I just destroy it? Where is it? I should have it in my bag, right? I don't see it in my bag. I 
That's a, those are regular no ways. So how would I arm the keys? I'm so confused right now. Maybe it's this desk right here? I don't know how to arm it. It's strange. Upstairs? This is it. Alright boys, we're gonna do it. Um, uh, am I sure? Alright. Warning. Reactor detonation. It's finished. All the directives you gave me have been completed. All except one. When the station detonates, it will destroy the Apex Typhon and every trace of technology derived from it. Including you. Already. It was your idea, after all. The alien neuromods you carry would pose an unacceptable risk to everyone on Earth if you returned. Have a seat, Morgan. You might as well enjoy the view in your final moments. Warning, reactor detonation imminent. Please evacuate Talos 1. All right, I'll have a seat. I see how I said I could escape, but just, just gotta do it. Morgan, I... I keep having this dream. It. That was good, I guess, right? That's whatever. I mean, you had to do it. it. Looks like the Earth is safe, though. So, I mean, we did our job. I mean, it's what, the people on the ship versus how many? Uh, 7 billion? I think that's how many people were in there. Hope you guys enjoyed the playthrough. I thought it was pretty good. I'm gonna let these credits roll. But if you guys enjoyed the playthrough, make sure to subscribe and like. Our next thing will be the Rainbow Six montage, obviously. That'll be like one video, but. We'll probably do Resident Evil Silent Hill, unless I change my mind. But, I'll let these credits roll and I'll talk to you guys later.
It's finished. How did it do? Activation of the mirror neurons is promising. Empathy quotient shows to be exceptionally high. It probably thinks it was dreaming, and nothing mattered. You're assuming it thinks like us. Its life depends on it. Ours too. It all comes down to the choices it made. It saved me from the cargo container. I would have suffocated otherwise. It installed multiple Typhon-based neuromods. It could mean an instinctive return to its own kind. Or an attempt to integrate its dual natures. Michaela. 
I would have died without my medication. That wasn't easy. That says a lot, I think, about its heart. Can I say that it has a heart? Then, there was a man in psychotronics, Ingram. Things did not end well for him. But... Would you let it live? Yes. Sarah, you're next. The situation in the cargo bay was bad. None of us would have survived without its help. And it destroyed a large number of Typhon across the station. That has to be a good sign. Further, it thwarted Dar's attempt to use us as hostages. If it were one of my officers, I would give it a commendation. Danielle, what do you say? It found me. It didn't need to. But it did. I asked it to stop Volunteer 37, but it left him alive. It could mean a low drive for retribution. A lot of humans controlled by the Typhon ended up dead. Not that it was easy to avoid, but... I just don't think it's worth the risk. In the end, it chose to destroy Talos One. Why? To protect her? We can't really know what its motives were for anything it did. But we have to make a choice. You can hear us, can't you? Here, I want to show you something. What you experienced was a reconstruction based on Morgan's memories. This is the world today. We spent years trying to put what you can do into us. We never tried putting what we can do into you. Until now. You're the bridge between our species. I need to know if you see us. I mean really see us. Take my hand if you do. We're gonna shake things up, like old times. <laughs>